Hello and welcome to a new video. Today we are playing the vampire let's play a little bit because we want to do that. Um, we are currently at the Spencer Kim Lewis house, which might be a third contestant for a baby. We actually made two babies last episode with Bella Goth and I forgot the other one's name. Naomi, I think. And we'll see if we have to move them into our house later on to for them to give birth and we being able to keep the babies in our house. Oh no, that's not a good sign. They just kissed. They clearly love each other. What can I do? I have to break them apart because she has to be our third contestant. That sounds so horrible. No, leave. I don't want you to be angry. Ugh. In the last episode, we actually um, dodged two of the husbands, which is good because they weren't home either, or the other one was just very oblivious. He didn't really see that we made out with his wife. I don't know what was going on there, but he is very present. And that's not a good thing at all, because I want him to leave so we can have a baby with uh, her. I, I really don't know what her name is. Uh, Yeah. Uh, so let's just, Alice, let's just try and get, get to know her, be a little bit nice to her, you know, you can't hurt ev anything to be nice to her and just get the friendliness thing up. Is that her dad? Oh my gosh, everybody lives in this household, right? I think his mom as well. I just gave this family a makeover in my other safe and I, it was very confusing who is who and I, I really didn't figure it out. Okay. Bella Goth, what do you want from me? Hey, Raphael, you're so notorious that one of my unscrupulous friends has been asking to meet you. Can I give them your number? I don't think that anything will come of it either way. Ooh, Vivian. Vivian? Can we drink from her? Is that mean to drink from her? It's an old lady. Bella, what do you want? No, I don't want to go out with you. Sorry. Stop calling me. My gosh. Second time in a row. Okay. Hello, Vivian Lewis. I really like you. Can I drink your blood? Because I need to. I'm I'm starving. I'm not really starving, but I need to drink something sooner or later. So let's just drink Vivian while she's here, right? Let's just drink from her. Oh, <laughs> her son walked in. He said, eh, I don't care. I'm complaining about the TV show that's on, but not about him drinking from my mother. Bella, again? It's good to hear your voice, Raphael. I wanted to ask if I should get to know Maggie Cho a little bit. They seem like good company. I mean, why not? Oh, Maggie is the one, that our second baby mama. That's her, not whatever I said before. That's her, okay. Um. Oh, she's alone. Look, we can now flirt with her. Uh, Hello. Can we flirt with you? Do you want to have a baby with us? Because I really need another baby. And you would be perfect for this. Just perfect. You are, you already have one kid, so one more can't hurt you, right? Oh, the first kiss. The first kiss. Aww. That's probably a very good thumbnail. So, thank you so much for that. Um, yeah. Uh, so yeah, let's make a baby, shall we? I hope we can do this today. Um, can I talk to her? Can I talk about her clothing? Like, what is that? Why did EA think that this is such a good idea to dress her in those clothes? That really weird skirt with that really weird top, it's they're, it's both hideous. And then this hair, I don't know. They could have done her a little bit better, right? Maggie Cho? No, I don't want to go out. I'm busy. <sighs> Baby mamas. Oh, the husband is coming. That's not a good sign. Can you please leave? We have something to do. Oh, yeah, he's angry. Leave. We have something to do, okay? I'm sorry. Yeah, you can be mad, but I don't care. We have something to do. Now leave us alone. Get out of your own bedroom. I hope it's your bedroom. I don't know if that's... The bedroom of your mother, because that would be very weird if it is. Who knows who? Maggie Jo, why is everybody, like, stalking me today? What is wrong? They're so clingy. My goodness. First, Bella Goth, like, a million times, and then her. Oh, did you see that? No, you're not doing this to your wife. 
No, absolutely not. You know, we. I will fight you, Eric. Who do you think you are? My goodness, to slap a wife just because she cheated on you? Come on, do better. Are you okay, sweetheart? Come on. Everything is fine. I will distract you from him. He's an idiot. Come with me. You can live with me for a little bit. But not your kid. Oh, he's very mad. Not your kid. Only you. You can have your kid and then leave again. No, that's... Me. So, we should make another video because we have to make money. We don't have any. We have 170, 175 simoleons. That's not enough for us. So, we have to make videos, you know? And I love The Sims because with every video that you upload, you can make money. That's not the same as on YouTube, you know? YouTube doesn't let you do that from the first video. You have to get partnered first. But he can do that. I mean, it's not a lot of money, but he can still make some money. Oh, look, he's dazed from his fight. Did he win? Probably not, right? Even though he has, like, vampire strength. I don't know how to name those videos, so I'm just gonna leave them like that. I should name them something funny, I know, but maybe I'll do that in the future. So, showering and then going to bed, because we are very tired after that fight. You know, we drank something, but that's already out of our system somehow. Probably because of the fight and everything like that. Should we have fought him? I mean, come on, he... He fucking, he freaking slapped his wife. I mean, she cheated, but that is not a reason to slap her, right? She, he could have talked to her or something like that. Ugh, men, I'm telling you, they're the worst. Just kidding, just kidding. Don't cancel me. Um, so let's go to bed. And then tomorrow we have to see if what we can do. Um, I think three women are enough for the first few times, right? Maybe we have to see if they fall pregnant and we can move them in so we can have their babies and everything like that and then maybe go out and impregnate a few more. But I don't really want to have like a million babies running around here. So maybe how many people can live in the household? Eight, I think. So we could have seven babies, but who wants to raise seven babies or seven toddlers? I think three are enough for the first time. And then we should probably uh, have another three or something like that down the line. And then when they move out, we can do others, if that makes sense. Like, it's going to be a long time till we have a lot of kids i don't know how many we want to have i don't know how many women there are that we can have babies with if that makes sense but yeah it's going to be a lot i'm telling you he's going to have the biggest family ever and my my game is probably going to crash because he has so many kids and stuff should we also like have a human another human move in that we can feed off of if that makes sense because those plasma things they don't really do anything to us they feed us a little bit and then he has so much hunger left that he has to like we have to eat two or three of those bags and that's not going to be very wise right so we maybe should have somebody move in or somebody close by that we can feed off of so we don't have to go out and do something okay let's invite some bella goth to see if she's actually pregnant or not maybe we will see a belly already i don't know i hope um no i don't know is she she looks as as amazing as ever then let's let's just film another video you know we have nothing to do either way we have to wait until we can see if they're pregnant or not because i don't want to like i said go out and impregnate other people if they already are pregnant so how do we name this love tips from a hot one <laughs> video description eh. okay uh yeah bella i don't know maybe we should move her in to see if she's pregnant actually or something so i'm pretty sure she's pregnant right she has to be if she isn't let's just move her in and then um impregnate her that's how many times can i say this it's going to be like very weird if to say this every two minutes okay let's move her in join household I don't no don't go and watch TV. Let's move in together. Only you. Maybe you will move back soon. Just leave your family for us, Bella. And then maybe we can transfer some money 
um how many yeah i mean i don't really want to want too much let's say oh no not uh ten thousand is that an, is that too much ah come on come on they have enough he makes enough money they live in a huge mansion so they have nothing to lose right um oh she has to go to work girl how didn't you tell me why are you here if you have to go to work she just showed up at the doorstep weird anyway let's edit the video and then upload it because like i said we also have to make money and yeah the editing software looks kind of similar to mine okay this is the sped up part this is just going to be a little voiceover right here because i wanted to kind of change the house a little bit because there will be probably two or three toddlers living here in a minute and a few you know women that have to live here and they can't sleep in a coffin they have to sleep in a bed and i don't know i don't think that they will permanently live here i think that that I think that I will move them back to their family once they gave birth. So I will have one double bed probably somewhere and then have baby beds or not baby beds, toddler beds and stuff in this room down here probably because, yeah, we need them, right? Where else are, are the babies going to sleep? And so right here will probably be the bedroom for the mothers to sleep in so right now bella and maybe we have to move in somebody else soon because like i said we want the babies to live here if they actually are pregnant and are vampires if not they can move back to their family that sounds harsh but he just wants you know vampire babies he doesn't want anything else and he wants to have the biggest vampire family in the world and teach them everything and stuff like that like i said in the first episode so that's going to happen and i know it's not ideal i will one of those you know times in the future i will actually just tear this entire house down and build a new one because that just looks kind of weird right now right but it does what it should do and it has a, a bunch of beds in and a kitchen and everything so it it does what it has to do and we don't have a lot of money to spare so that's just you know it's everything that we can afford right now so it's pretty okay i don't mind it too much let's give it a roof because you know it looks weird without a roof and that's about it Okay, so she's home from work and we are going to read the vampire book because we want to master the vampire skills as well. We want to be a great vampire better than Vlad or Vlad or whatever you call him. I don't know. Let her cook something because she's the only one in this house who eats. Maybe he should be learning to cook something so she can he can cook for her, you know? That would be nice even though he, does, he knows that she's not going to permanently live here. But yeah, it sh it is nice if you will cook for her because she has to work. All he has to do is like, I mean, he has to take care of kids soon and she's not going to live here anymore or any longer. But right now she does. So maybe he should make some food for her, you know? Yeah, feel the baby. Come on, feel the baby. It's so cute. Aw, what is she wearing, by the way? This is the stuff that she has to wear at the job. Is she what is why does she look like an astronaut i know she's not um let's put this in his inventory so he can read whenever he wants to let him read by the way again because like i said we want the skill level to go up she ate a very bad thing yeah but you cooked so maybe you have to learn how to cook again before you complain about your own food that you made girl i know it didn't taste good it didn't look good either you know but let's actually go ahead and see if the other women are pregnant so we know that bella is but let's visit spencer kim lewis um yeah she's not home so spencer kim lewis it has to do um where is she where is she where is she oh while we're here and he hates us regardless we could also drink something from him right drink a big a deep drink because why not we're here, we're thirsty, we have to drink from him, because, look, we can't starve, and we don't have any plasma things anymore, so we have to do what we have to do, we're a vampire, what can we do? And he hates us, he hates his wife, he hit his wife, so maybe we should rescue her from him, and he deserves it, let's be real. What a weirdo, what a meanie he is. Um, now he's, oh, oh yeah, she's definitely pregnant. She is definitely pregnant. 
You can see that from her belly. Can you see her belly? Obviously you can. But, I mean, look at. She isn't wearing those weird-ass clothes anymore. And I'm pretty happy about that. I know it's just her sleepwear, her pajama or something like that. But still an improvement to what she was wearing on her normal days. Because that was just hideous. By the way, I gave the Spencer Kim Lewis household a makeover. If you want to see that, go check it out. It's on my channel right now. <laughs> Sorry. So, yeah. What are we doing here? Maybe we should check on the other girl, hoping that she's home right now. Oh, she is home. Okay, let's see if she is pregnant. Where is she? Where is she? There's her daughter or son or whatever. There she is. There she is. Oh, yeah. She is pregnant as well. She is patting her belly like my little one, you know? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we have three babies. I didn't think this through because I have to raise three toddlers now. See, he actually is cooking something for Bella. Oh, my gosh. Can vampires bleed? Can they hurt, can they hurt themselves so much? I mean, come on. Shouldn't the blade just snap in half against your skin and we should move in her as well let's move her in i guess in a second because she will give birth too we have to get uh, move the other one in as well so she can give birth as well and we keep the baby but we'll see maybe we can do this next episode because i think we won't do this 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 episode anymore this episode is probably very long already but yeah, um, yeah, let's talk about something. I don't know what you're talking about. Bella's home. Oh no, is she gonna get mad? Is she mad already? I think she's mad already. Did she see something? I mean, she doesn't look good. But let's move her in right now. Alice, come on with me. I know your mother, no, your dad lives in the other house and your daughter, but oh, they have enough money too. Let's get some money from them as well. Okay. So. I don't know. Is it wrong to do that? I don't care. We have to do it. We have to get some money for our family. So let's do it, I say. Okay, this is it. Let's see if we can move the other girl in next week and if some babies are being born. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, subs like subscribe and comment down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Goodbye. <laughs>